Africa should actively engage in the, in the debates that will help end the ukraine russia conflict where some of the words of Abdul Latif Koulibaly, Secretary General of the Senegalese government. His remarks came after United Nations Secretary General Antonio Guterres met in Dakar with the Senegalese President Macky Sall, who doubled as the chairperson of the African Union for the year 2022. Now, according to the Senegalese top official, the African continent is highly dependent on Russia and Ukraine for wheat imports, so the ongoing conflict, according to him, will inevitably impact food security in Africa. And let's take a listen to him in this insert. One of the fundamental reasons which expresses the arrival of Antonio Guterres here is the situation currently unfolding in the sub-region and internationally. Remember, you have been informed that the President of the Republic of Senegal has spoken to Russian and Ukrainian authorities. He has cleared a wise that this war has had quite harsh economic consequences in our respective states. But from that moment, it is clear to know that Africa should participate in the debates, and the President of the Republic takes an important part in this on behalf of Africa, but also on behalf of his country in these discussions, and the reflections should lead to negotiations so that this war finally ends. Senegal is now witnessing a fairly significant price hike, mainly related to the war between Russia and Ukraine. Today, these two countries are granaries for wheat, and we are major importers of wheat. This crisis also has consequences for other products, notably oil and gas. We have experienced this situation with great difficulty, as have all the countries in the world. But we also have the capacity for resilience, which means that today we are in an economic difficulty, but have tried to cope with the situation. The meeting with President Macky Sall was an extremely important meeting for Africa and also for international organizations, especially in Europe, where a war broke out. And for 70 years, we have been facing this kind of war, unfortunately. Senegal has always been active on the diplomatic front and we have a fairly clear and wise position on conflicts around the world. And I think that this wise and enlightened position also allows us to be able to participate effectively in the discussions.